So Adam, uh, three points at Workington today. Uh, not the best of games, a bit scrappy, but happy with the three points. Yeah, um, wasn't a great game, like you say. Um, I don't think we played particularly well at all, if I'm being honest. But um, you know, I think it's important that when you don't play well, that you defend well and keep a clean sheet. And um, you know, all in all, big credit to the lads. You know, we've had two back-to-back -back away games, very tough coming up here on a Tuesday night. And uh, whilst I don't think we've been at our best in in the last couple of games. Uh, to come away with four points is very pleasing. Yeah, so a good reaction today on the back of Staley busy and a bit of a disappointment on Saturday. Yeah, I, I felt we should have won the game on Saturday. We, we played a lot better um, in the second half um, on Saturday, and we we had some chances that we should have, you know, we should have won the game, but we didn't do. And um, we said to the lads afterwards, you know, use that disappointment of not winning on Saturday to. Um, you know, to, to go and get three points tonight, and um, if we manage to do that, then all of a sudden the point on Saturday don't become such a bad one. So credit to the players for for going and uh, and digging out a one 0 win. Yeah, and I thought um, Danny Ellis looked good coming on for Clayton in the second half. Looked really solid. Yeah. Good to have him back. Yeah. You know, he's, he's our captain. He's a leader. Um, he was arguably our best player until he got injured. You know, the season, and uh, he's missed three weeks with a hamstring. He's had to be patient the last week or so because the you know the players that have been playing have been getting good results and they're in good form. So uh, he came on on Saturday as a striker and made an impact on the game. And um, you know as soon as Clates had an issue at half time today, Danny just you know came on, showed showed what a good player he is, and uh, I thought he was excellent. Cool. And um, up to fourth tonight. Um, just a case of keep plugging away, keep getting the points, picking the points up, and. Same way it takes us, I guess. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's our 14th game, which um, that's that's a third of the way through the season now, and um, you know, to have got the points that we have, I'm, I'm quite satisfied with that. Um, you know, we know that there's a long, long way to go, and um, we so, certainly won't be taking our our start for granted. Um, I think we've got a lot of improving to still do. I think we can still get better, and I'm certain that we will do. But we've certainly you know, had a, had a reasonable start and put ourselves in a good position and it uh, gives us a bit of a, of a platform now to build on. OK, and just finally, uh, Big House on Saturday, uh, FA Trophy, um, important for everyone, I guess, to get on a decent cup run, if we can. Yeah, um, obviously, you know, all, all clubs want to do well in the FA, you know, FA Cup, the FA Trophy. Um, you know, we're no different, so it's uh, it's, it's a good um, it's a good change of um, of priority for us now. This Saturday, you know, we, we we've had a great run in the league. We've put ourselves in a good position, and now we've got to prepare for for what will be a very difficult game against Brighouse, who are doing very well in the league below. Uh, it's a bit of a local derby, and um, you know, obviously the the, the financial um, impact that it can have on the club if you can put a little run together is is massive, and we're well aware of that. So we'll be. Uh, We'll be going all out to win, but hopefully if we can, you know, play like we have been doing and uh, and uh, you know get another positive result, that'll uh, that'll be good for everybody connected to the club.